Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. Sarah here. Today I am going shopping for a water bottle, which I know sounds really, really simple, but I'm going specifically for a little handheld water bottle that I can use during my trail runs. And so if you're watching this video, I can pretty safely assume you might be interested in purchasing a running water bottle soon. And uh, I just kind of want to go over the four main things I found while I was doing research on what to get, what to look for when you're purchasing your running water bottle. So the first thing is the volume. So how much water or liquid can it hold? And it seems like it ranges from like 12 ounces to 20 ounces. And this might vary depending on what you're training for or how much you run. Um, I don't really need too much. I just need a little bit of water to get me through a lot more. So um, that's not a super important factor to me today. The second thing you might want to look for is if there's a pocket. Pockets are really popular for if you're running long distances and you might need food or snacks. I don't anticipate running those kinds of distances, so I don't really care about a pocket. The third thing is if it's collapsible or not. So the collapsible water bottles are really, really small once they are empty, and they are also very, very lightweight. So ultra runners often go with these, I think, because they're so lightweight. Um, I don't think I really want to deal with that. It seems like it would be sloshing around a lot more than a water bottle. Um, so I... And personally looking for a hard water bottle as opposed to a collapsible one and the fourth thing that popped up was if it's insulated or not and um, the purpose of me getting this is because it's been warming up so I am going to be going in looking specifically for an insulated water bottle that's probably the number one thing I'm looking for in the shopping trip is something that is insulated but I'm gonna go in and see what they have I am at a local running store called Fleet Feet I think they have um, a national presence but this is owned locally and um, you know I like supporting local businesses so let's go see what they have All right, so I ended up getting the Nathan Quick Squeeze Light Insulated. And they also had like regular Quick Squeeze, not insulated. And it was obviously like a little lighter, but I really wanted the insulated, like that was the biggest thing for me. And they only had it in 12 ounces, so that's what I got. But actually 12 ounces is a lot more than I thought. So this is plenty for me and just for funsies. I also got some noon hydration tabs. I've never tried these before. I've only ever tried like the Gatorade Powerade like powder packs. And so I've never tried the noon. I'm interested to kind of compare them and yeah, I'm so excited. So I'll test run this water bottle and maybe give it a little review or something later once I've done some more runs in it. And yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you next week. Bye.